Welcome everyone to another video. Today I just want to make a quick tutorial on how to check your display settings here in Windows 10. And this can be used in a situation where you need to change anything from your resolution to the refresh rate or you just want to change which display is your main monitor. All of that can be done here in these settings. And so to get started, if we just right click and go to display settings, and then up here at the top, it's going to display all of the monitors that it detects. If you're not sure which one is which, you can actually click on identify and it will tell you which monitor you are currently looking at. And whichever one you have selected here is going to be what, uh, what settings are applied to that monitor. And so starting from the top, we can set up a schedule for turning off blue light. We can control HDR if you have an HDR uh, monitor. Right here, we can change the percentage for text and apps, and this is uh, useful for eyesight issues. Right here is where you can change the resolution if needed. You can also change it from landscape to portrait if you want to rotate your monitor. And right here, we can actually change whether we duplicate the display or extend it. Most people use extend, and you can also come up here and adjust the monitors as needed, move them if needed. Uh, you just click and drag and then click on apply to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and click on cancel because I don't want to make any changes. And then down here at the bottom, make this my main display. Right now, this one is the main display, but if I click on this one, we can actually check that box and change the main display if we wanted to do so. But currently I'm going to leave that as is. And then at the bottom, we have advanced options. If I go ahead and click on that, up here at the top, if you have multiple monitors, you just click on the drop down and you can select whichever one you want to view. It will give you information on that monitor. And then right here is where you can change the refresh rate if needed. This is something you definitely want to check if you bought a new monitor because usually by default, it will default to 60 rather than 120 or 144, whichever you purchase. I should also mention that you can display the refresh rate by clicking on display adapter right here. And then in this window, just select monitor. You can see there is a drop down menu. Just be sure that once you make a selection, you click on apply and then OK. Now, for those of you that have an NVIDIA graphics card, uh, what you'll want to do is come down here and type in NVIDIA control panel. And then once you type that in, it should be the top result. NVIDIA control panel. Go ahead and open that up. Now, this is going to give you a lot of the same options that we saw in the Windows 10 display settings. For example, you can change the resolution here. You can select whichever monitor you would like to double check or make a change to. This is where it will list the uh, resolution. You can change the refresh rate here. If you do make any changes, an apply button will appear. I'm just going to click on cancel because I don't want to make any changes. We can also rotate the display right here if we wanted to do so. But the main thing here that I want to point out, set up G-Sync. If you have a G-Sync monitor or a G-Sync compatible monitor, this is where you'll go to enable G-Sync. Make sure you have the correct monitor selected. Check the box, check the box, and then you will want to just make sure to apply those settings. But that's just a quick rundown on how to check your display settings. Again, very useful, especially if you purchased a new monitor. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you found it helpful, please go ahead and consider sharing it. And please also consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notifications on future videos.